All right, welcome back to iRacing. So back racing at Michigan in the NASCAR Legends. Driving my 1987 Chevy Monte Carlo, my Thundercats paint scheme. So even though I have a win here this week, um, I'm running again to try to get more points. Because that win I got, unfortunately, was kind of in a weak strength of field. So strength of field for this race is obviously higher, so... I'm car 5 out of 14, so yeah, higher strength of field in this race. So hopefully, I, Good luck, everyone. hopefully have I have a chance at least to try to get some more points and get a deal. I'm happy with wherever I finish, yeah, but, luck, but if I can get more points than, than the last time, that would be good. So yeah, like I said, race to have fun. See, so yeah, I qualified second, and a bunch of us are actually really close. In terms of lap times, so yeah, I'll be starting to side of Matt. He's really fast. All right, see so, ya, yeah. Thundercats. You have two additional sets of tires for this right. Be smooth and have a good run. I guess. We're on one to go. Oh, I gotta see it. Be on our this side this time. Thunder, thunder, really thunder, Thundercats. Ho! Oh! I know Matt's going to be a lot faster than me. I know that for sure. And I know a bunch of these other guys are probably going to be a lot faster than me. But what really matters is just surviving, you know. But also, if I can at least just salvage a few more points or so, then I'm happy. But yeah, I was surprised to qualify second for the race. So I didn't think I'd actually qualify this high up because I thought a lot of those other guys would be a lot quicker than I was. But, but yeah, starting second is a huge surprise. So I don't hurt my neck. <laughs> As it's kind of a bummer having to look up at the screen. Yeah. But that's just sadly how it is. Give me a quick radio check, please. Support, thank you. I don't know when Matt's going to go here. All right, but pace cars off. Be ready. All right. Green flag. The road's open. Yeah, I have a feeling that this race is probably going to be... I have a feeling this is probably going to be a long run race, so... But if I could keep up with Matt, that would be awesome. 48.806. Good dog, you're looking good. Now go get that leader. loose. Saved it though. <laughs> oh, Matt got a little squirrely there. Coming out of four. 42.43. Just gotta stay in it. Just gotta stay in the draft. That's all I gotta do. Try not to lose sight of him. Because if me and Matt can draft together, we could definitely drive away from the guys behind. The problem is that those guys behind are probably going to be getting, um... And so 
just trying to be careful with the tires, but also just be easy on the car. So push. Just gonna try to get down to the bottom here. Kind of gets a little, kind of car almost feels like it comes to a standstill in the corner there. It's like that all of a sudden it just stops turning. That's weird. <laughs> all right, but in either case, really all I want to do is just try to try to you know stay with Matt if I can. I know I'm probably won't hey, be. You're gonna make your move after you done made the second and almost a half gap. Yeah, kind of stuff. But then again, really, my mission is just to survive. So even if I don't get it, it's alright. You burnt your shit up getting line, sucker. Alright. Well, in either case, I'll just pull my tires down a little bit. Nicholas, since you've been patiently waiting, I will let you go whenever you like. Six, two. But I try to want to keep
Gotta be nice and easy. Nice and easy on the car. Yeah, so far I've been able to keep up with Matt here, which is pretty surprising. So I thought Matt would just drive, Matt would easily just drive away from me. But yeah, I'm just trying to take it easy on the car. You know, don't do anything stupid, so to speak. Got something going on in front of us here. <laughs> caution, caution. Oh, of course. They gotta then throw the yellow. Come on. Yeah, I'm gonna get a look at your temp clear on Come on, man. The the They're both close. Alright, buddy. Line up behind this one. Yeah, you can thank the 13 for that. How much fucking space you need, dork? What the hell happened there after the uh, wreck? Not sure. Not sure. Just got run over by somebody three and a half minutes after the freaking wreck happened. Okay, there's a pace car right on the back stretch. Fucking wreck was all over the damn track from wall to the grass. See, I'm gonna probably may want to pit. I don't know what. Pit hey, cars, middle do. back shit. Pit road is open. I don't know what Matt's gonna do here. He'll, he'll probably. I would probably assume he might pit. So I don't know. So that was 13 laps, 12 laps, 13 laps on racing, so I don't know what I'll do. Yeah, I'll just come in with him and follow him inside the pits. Yeah, I gotta slow down to the pit speed. Nine, I didn't mean to hit you, buddy. You just slammed on the brakes. I didn't expect you to slow down that much. Yeah, no, I just don't want to speed in the pits. Again, I, I didn't mean to, dude. All right. Yeah, I didn't want to speed in the pits, that's for sure. Christopher, what were you doing, man? Okay, so yeah, I wanted to... I would love to know why you just wrecked me on the straightaway for absolutely no reason. Ready, yeah. Go, man, go, go, man, go, 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 go! Of course I knew Matt would be one set of the leader. So I knew Matt would get out ahead of me, so. <laughs> no probs there. Alright, looks like you're gonna be lining up behind one. Again, you slowed down all of a sudden, my guy. You went incredibly low and just stabbed on the brakes. You were doing probably below 50 before you even got into the pits. Man's complaining, but he can't hear anybody in the woods yet. I'm not gonna fucking type to him. Yes, follow. Matt here. Now, I know Ryan, he's pretty fast, so I probably... One, two, go. You really have nothing to say, one, Christopher? So I got a feeling one, that he's two, probably going to get around us, or at least me, because, you know, he's Division 1, so he could challenge Matt probably for the lead. But me, you know, I don't know. <laughs> so... Being a Division Two driver, you know. Pretty cowardly to wreck a guy on the straightaway and then just not say anything, it's not even defend that, yourself, not even say sorry. Yeah, it's just obvious I wouldn't have the pace. That of was a the, retaliation deal, looked like. 
of the uh, gen of the um, division. Yeah, turn one it guys. in and move on. Before you piss them off and you ruin some more races. Yeah, but yeah, I just wouldn't really have the pace that Matt or Ryan would have, because I know, and then of course Brandon behind me, he's pretty, he's quick too. I'm not gonna ride all the way Tires up there. Up there the hot wall. I don't want to hit the wall by accident. But I know that these guys won't hit the wall. I know that for sure. I don't know when he's gonna go. I'll anticipate when he's gonna go. Pace the cars off. Be ready. <laughs> all right. Green, 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 green. One minute forty point three. It's anticipating when he was going to go there on the start. And I got to watch out. There's car moving back yeah, onto the track. Watch out 13. Inside. Thanks so much. Glad the 13 didn't really interfere, which is awesome. Glad 13 at least got out of the way, so I'm happy about that. 44.5. Whoa, a little loose. <laughs> Just trying to drive smooth here, you know. Kind of hard doing that sometimes. Right. Oh, almost looked like Matt there got into the wall, but he didn't hit it, so that's good. Let's see what it caused a log jam behind me. Don't worry about me. Oh, a little loose. Saved it though. Good day for. Thank you, bud. hesitant to get back to the gas there because the car got a little car got a bit tight there 42.7 
Car kind of bobbled a bit there in the corner. Now I'm gonna lose a little time to Matt. Yeah, that little bobble there cost me a tenth. And to think, and to think that, and to think that uh, Panthro actually built me a really good car for this race. And Panther, why'd you have to make this thing so darn twitchy? Good thing is, I'm slowly stretching it out over Ryan behind me. So I thought Ryan would really gain on me. So I thought Ryan was going to close on me really quickly and pass me. But yeah, I'm surprised actually that um, eh, it's going to be easy with the car. Me and Matt are actually starting to slowly reel some real in traffic. And Nick there in 11 just got around Ryan in the 3. So I thought Ryan in the 3 was just going to easily instantly eat up the gap because you know, I was thinking he was going to be a lot quicker than me there for a second. So I thought, really, during the early stint, I thought he was just going to eat me up instantly. 43.295. Hey, Rocky, three, three, one. save some of that speed for X. You'd be a lot quicker, but You've overdrove entry like seven times thinking that's going to pass you. Save it for X, and we wouldn't have this huge-ass gap between us and the leaders. Well, I've been on the back of this the whole time. I've been kind of just riding, actually. Boom! Yeah, right, bud. 
Alrighty. I mean, I really didn't want to get under you. It's just, you know, I rolled the bottom a little better than you roll on the high side. Oh, nine. Outside. Thank you. No, I was the one actually Four, three, killing, and you're trying one, to overdrive eight. entry. I'm done here. He's right, and you're wrong. Well, I'm tense and digging like hell. Come on. Like, you're obviously faster, but save it for exit. That's where it would matter. Like, I'd give you a bump draft, and we'd be past these two fellas. Sam 11's been holding us up. I'm good, brother. I'm, I'm just kind of riding. There's a lot of racing left, you know? Yeah. 43.361. Just doing what I can and try to keep Matt in sight. It's really hard though because you usually got to draft and then kind of lose in touch with them a well, bit. That sucks there too. Yeah, and plus me and Matt are starting to run into traffic. That's why I'm having a tough time kind of staying with them. So I got to time the moves getting through traffic, right? So I know me and Matt now have to get through lots of traffic. I know that for sure. <laughs> Do something. I got a lap car. Tell him, Rock. All right. If I catch you guys from two seconds back, something's up. Four, zero, five. We can't stay single file for the life of us. Uh, I have a feeling the slap car is going to get in the way. I just have a feeling slap car is going to get in the way. Please inside. get out of the way, 13. Thank you. Clear on the We're bottom. single file now. Kind of. I was going to try to say thank you, but problem is... I've been watching you guys battle it out since the restart. problem is the other guys are yappy. Can't really... Can't exactly hey, get a message in. So can't exactly get a thank you message into the 13 for letting me go there. Want me to give you a little bump off one of the corners? I wouldn't mind. 
He's going overdrive three just like that, and we should be. Give it to me. Come on. Where you at, Bob? <laughs> I'm back here getting ready to go three wide with three car going into one. Well, Dale, yeah. Look at us all overdriving entry for what? Let's get a single file. Got 20 some laps to go, and we're racing like it's two to go. Gotta watch out for that wall. Yeah, we've been racing. I know that's right. This is a hotly contested third place, huh? How are we looking on fuel miles? It's like, whoa, loose. I'm good. Should be good on fuel, I think, the rest yeah, of the I'm way. Yeah, I learned my lesson yesterday on that deal. Yeah, I think I should be all right on. I think we should all be good on fuel, I think. I don't think none of us have to worry about saving fuel. So I don't think anybody, I don't think any of us have to worry about saving fuel if at you all. you get a run, pass me or push me. That's your call. Look at that, we're actually catching. 43, Got I just gained five cents go on right you guys in just the lap. Yeah. I can though to stay with Matt, I'm trying to keep up with them. Oh, damn, you couldn't get any closer, I can tell you. 43.14. Yes, sir. We got some time to make up. You see that relative ticking the right way, don't you? There right, should be good now. Don't get me nervous. You're good, brother. I'm riding.
tell I'm also slightly gaining on Matt a little bit with the draft. So I can tell I'm starting to get in the drafting range. Tell I'm starting to get in his drafting range. So that draft is very, very helpful, especially here at Michigan. Because so that way if I can at least just draft with him, you know, that would be awesome. Please wait until we check out. Just go, baby, go, baby, go. Uh oh. There's oh. not a chance we catch up with the leader. Unless, oh, I see smoke. Never mind. Uh, it's a... Yeah, it's like a nine blew up. That should have worked itself out. We gotta beat the guys behind us. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I've been catching you guys like crazy. You know, Tanner, I've been hearing you all this race, but I think I just now see you on the relative. Brandon's up here taking it easy, kind of fiddling around, I think. Then quit pussyfooting around and get on my bumper and push me. This ain't no one-man show. We're going 200. Oh, it's funny. My headset died uh, in that right before the first caution, so I had a fit and go to the back. I'm just having fun watching you guys kind of battling out. It's been interesting how you guys are working together. Pretty cool. Yeah, right. This guy's a dick. He hasn't touched my bumper once, but he can overdrive entry like anybody else. Must be holding him up. Let me let him go. I sure hear them tires whining, though. Cool them puppies off. Because I hope you could take a push. Show you how to go fast. Look at that, it's like night. And watch this, I'll back off on entry so you don't overdrive it. Like you've been doing the last 30 laps. Whoa, loose. It's like, whoa, loose. Saved it, though. Been trying to take care of it, man. Shut up. Aw, oh, man. Why did you say that? <laughs> I was going to say, oh, why'd you tell him to shut up? He's giving us some color commentary. All right. 43.075. Okay, now it's got to be really easy now. So I think the tires are starting to really take a beating, so got to be really cautious. Nearly four seconds ahead of third place. Catching it. Can't push no harder without passing. Okay. My bad. I was a little early. I'm not trying to wreck I'm trying to bump grab so you got to go fast. Yeah, roger that. No, no problem, brother. He's just one second. He's in our draft, so he's here to rumble now. Don't worry about me. I'm trying to keep it straight, brother. That's all. I know some fellas like try to hide that inside when I'm just trying to go fast. I'm not worried about passing you right now. That'll slow us both up and Tanner will be out front. Stay high coming off of two down here. I'll pull down and let you get back in front because I'm slowing down. Whoa, loose. In fourth. Okay, so hopefully this 13 car is careful as I'm going to be coming through. Side. Thank you. Clear. Yeah, I'm pretty hurt, Ken. I'll stay low here. Forty-three point zero one Simple. six. Ten laps to go. He's 
been back there eating popcorn watching us rage for fucking nothing. Ah, uh, Brandon, I wouldn't trade that shit for nothing, brother. All right, now that made me chuckle. I'll give it to you. You're all right, Rocky. You're all right. <laughs> I don't appreciate that, sir. You just tried to shove me up in no man's land. 43.026. Better hope you got some tire for that. Never touched you. It's called Aero. If you don't gotta touch nobody, I'll teach you a thing or two about it. Oh, wait, no, I won't either. He's got a tire for days. What were you saying? Yeah, I won't be seeing you again. <laughs> I might blow it right front, actually. Yep, that's what it feels like. Yeah, I'm, I'm worried about the same damn thing. I could tell something going on a little earlier there. Hey, so it's gonna take care of the. Yeah, right. I just gotta hold your tie like nobody's business. Yeah, it's gonna take care of the tie, the right front. I have a feeling that right front's really worn, so I gotta keep an eye on that. I believe it's less than 30% on that right front right now. Okay. Shit, this gotta be more than that. Tanner just done gapped us by a second and a half. I just wish I didn't, my headset didn't die and I had to exchange out headsets. Damn. Cause you was shitting in there and getting it. Yeah, unfortunately. So let the car just kind of cruise on through the corner here. And I just hope that the slap car just lets me pass. Get this draft. Just get a slingshot. Keep it up, my man. Chrome, you're on the way. Inside, 42. Yeah, it's five, getting harder nine. and harder to get the car to turn on the right rear. Hopefully the tires hold up. Trouble. So hopefully the tires hold up for five more laps. So I know if a caution were to come out, unfortunately it wouldn't be the end because we would have one last restart. It'd have to be at least three to go or something like that for the race to be official. Like I said, there's really no point in running with Matt, so I just kind of backed off a bit, so I'm just going to, it's really what matters now, what matters now is just taking care of the tires and just trying to nurse these tires to the end. There's really no point in trying to go after Matt. You know, burnt your tires out real bad, six. Yeah, I just got the flat tire sign. Ah, right, so maybe he was overdriving injury. Not just cruising. Don't worry. Hey, said, you know, I'm just gonna get this. I'm a newbie at this, you know. Guys gotta, gotta learn. It's gotta nurse this car home. Yeah, so don't be a jack hat when somebody's trying to help you. Alrighty, three to go. Forty-two point nine five five. Yeah, like I said, I just want to nurse this car to the finish. 
no need to really go after Matt because he's too far ahead. Now we're both getting here with flat right front. So. You got a flat too. If it ain't this lap, it's gonna be next. I'm down to like 145 in the turns. Two laps to go. Cow. Should be two more laps. Forty-two point nine three six. Yeah, now nah, we good. Okay. Just ain't got nothing for them fellers up there. Russ passed me like I'm standing still. You know what's funny, Brandon? You're blaming me for that shit. <laughs> All right. Yeah, silly, because you're driving entry on my ass. White flag. White flag. One to go. You're overdriving entry. Please, tire, tell you, please you tires can front, hold up. You pass me, so I try to tell you nicely. Save your tires, bud. So chuckle about that. Let's just hope these you're tires the can hold up. You're the one with a flat tire, not me. Just for one more lap around, and I'll make it home free. Good thing is they have 7.5 seconds above draft me once this over third, race. so. And wonder why we're 10 seconds behind the leader. So yeah, third. <laughs> so yeah, third. Third's a long way back, so no need to push. Alrighty. Checkered flag. Bring it home in second. Alright. Congrats on the win, Matt. Thank you. Yep. Yeah. Checker flag, my man. Yeah, congrats on the win, Matt. Good run there, John. All right, man. Good job. Good job, man. Really, really good, good work there. All right, tires made it, so that's good. I'm happy. Yay. Well, at least Panthro actually built the car to where it can save the tires. That's for darn sure. I'm happy about that. All right. That'll do it for this week on iRacing. Oh, and before I go... The next gen cars are out now, so you can go ahead and buy those. I bought them already. <laughs> yeah, now I'm gonna be kind of going really fast, but who really cares, anyways? Just let this thing roll down the pits. All right, guys, turn your radios off. Make sure you save your batteries. Make sure the battery is in the car. The radio battery is in the car. Get turned off. Cut the master switch. All that stuff in the car. Yeah, like I said, he's t I think the car ain't gonna really stop. But I did it. I'll take home. I'll take home the second place, so that should get me more points. All right. This little Matt doing some burnouts. In 1987, they never did that, but. Still a goose tried to tell me he wasn't overdriving entry and then blows the right front with 10 to go. All right. Holy shit. Now I want to now I want to go back to that first wreck and see what what the heck happened to bring out the caution. It's around lap 12, I believe. So I just got to go back to lap 12. I don't know. Say so I just got to keep going back in order to um yeah, it's right around here, so let's go back through the field. So I just want to now see what, what happened here. Alright, now I want to see what, ha what the heck happened here. I was just wondering what happened here. I don't know who got wrecked, but um, I don't know who it was that got wrecked, but I'm not really sure. It's probably one of these guys, I think, that got. Yeah, 13 turns right down on the 7 and forces him, and then 7 just comes right back up into him. Yeah, I don't know what that was all about. Yeah, and then the four got hit from behind. 
Yeah, that was that was clear as day right there in terms of what caused the first caution. 13, he just turns right down into the 7. Guess not realizing he was under him or something. And then, um... Yeah, then the 9 tries to avoid, but then I guess he didn't see the 4 in front of him, and he just hits him in the back. Alright. Yeah, I guess 13 didn't know 7 was under him. Oh well. So either way, thanks for watching, and I will be back next week with some more iRacing at the, at the um, Week 9 tracks. So see you guys later. Bye!